Over 70% of Earth's volcanic activity occurs beneath the waves. The mixing of heat and chemicals in these regions create ecosystems called hydrothermal vents, in which organisms reside that can survive higher temperatures than any other life form known to man. In fact, these settings may have been the origin of life itself. Discoveries like these depend on continuous collection of data. However, measuring the ocean's processes while on a boat is far too periodic to provide the information we need to further understand this complex environment. Instead, we need a new approach, a way of looking at the ocean without even being there. 300 miles to the west of Oregon, deep beneath the sea surface, a network of cabled observatories has been installed around the largest underwater volcano off the coast, called Axial Seamount. This project, funded by the National Science Foundation, has created the largest undersea volcanic laboratory on Earth, providing brand new ways to examine the oceans and interact with these extreme environments. The instrumentation has been designed to withstand extreme temperatures ranging from near freezing to boiling, to endure pressures 250 times that on land, and to tolerate an entire ocean of corrosive salt water, all in the absence of light. Armed with these resilient tools, we can have a unique view into the mysteries of the deep. We will have a presence in the ocean at all times, measuring every variable we can. Instruments can detect a rise in the height of the volcano to the accuracy of a millimeter. Every earthquake trembling deep beneath the ocean is known about on land at the speed of light, with seismometers that can pick up even the faintest of vibrations. Motorized vehicles loaded with sensors are climbing cables that reach all the way from the ocean bottom to the sea surface, constantly measuring the chemistry and temperature of the sea every minute of every day. Biological and chemical sensors are strategically arranged on the sea floor to better understand this strange place where life is not driven from above by the sun, but from within the earth itself. And with a fiber optic cable running over 300 miles to shore, this network will generate a non-stop flow of real-time information coming directly from the oceans to people around the globe. Year-round, 24-7 collection of data soon to be available from anywhere with an internet connection. This communal tool will be used to create a shared consciousness within the ocean, one that students and scientists alike will be able to participate in.